What is up, Brace fans? My name is Owen, and welcome back to the Ben Fender Podcast. And in this one, I will be reviewing the Las Vegas uh, race, which is the third race in the NASCAR uh, season. Uh, first off, I apologize for last week's video. I went to upload it, uh, and for some reason it just did not upload, so I had to re-upload it. A little bit later. Um, so apologies for that. But without further ado, let's get into the review. So before the race, uh, Derek Kraus was making is making his um, Cup Series debut as he is uh, driving the number sixteen car. Uh, there are a couple of cars who had to go to the rear. Uh, which was Ross Chastain and Justin Haley, both for unapproved adjustments. And Ryan Priest, who was in a backup car, also had to go to the rear. So, starting off with Stage 1, it was 80 laps. Uh, Kyle Larson and Joey Logano were on the front row. Uh, Joey Logano leads uh, the initial laps. Then Kyle Larson takes the lead. Then uh, Zane Smith gets a little bit loose and makes contact with the wall. He ends up making it to pit road just fine. Uh, then a little bit while later, um, Christopher Bell blows a rear tire, which brings out the first caution of the race. Uh, Chris Buescher won the race off pit road. Then during the... This round of pit stops, Todd Gilliland got a over-the-wall-too-soon penalty. After that, uh, Chase Briscoe ends up taking the lead. Then William Byron takes the lead. And after that, um, Chris Buescher loses a tire, uh, which brought out the second caution of the race. Uh, Chris Buescher is out of the race, and this brought out a red flag. All right, so after the about 10 and a half minute uh, red flag, they went back racing, which uh, Daniel Suarez ends up leading. Then Kyle Busch takes the lead. Uh, right, be right before Kyle Larson takes the lead and ends up win winning stage one. So Kyle Larson is your stage one winner. At the end of stage one, there's only one car out and three cars that were lapsed down. Going on to stage two, it, it was 85 laps. Uh, Denny Hamlin won the race off pit road, but Martin Truex Jr. ends up leading. After that, Denny Hamlin ends up taking the lead. Then Ross Chastain takes the lead. Then Kyle Larson takes the lead. Then uh, the first round of green flag pit stop starts. And uh, Ross Chastain ends up taking the lead. And then on that round of pit stops, uh, Austin Sindrick and Ross Chastain both got two fast enter entering penalties. They said one car got a um, too fast exiting penalty, but I didn't catch who it was, unfortunately. After that, Kyle Larson retakes the lead. Then uh, Christopher Bell goes around and Bring out the third caution of the race. Then after that, Alex Bowman won the race off pit road. Ty Gibbs had a disaster stop. And um, he ended up getting an uncontrolled tire penalty. As well as having a very slow stop. Uh, after that, Kyle Larson took the lead. And Kyle Larson ends up winning stage two. So at the end of stage two, it was basically the same as stage one, other than there were four cars that were lapsed down. Going into the third and final stage, it was 102 laps. Uh, Bubba Wallace has a problem with um, one of his lug nuts on pit road. So it got stuck in the tire and, they, and the mechanics weren't able to get it out. So he was in there for like 13 laps as they sawed the wheel 
off and so that basically ended Bubba's day. After that, uh, Kyle Larson uh, leads. Bubba Wallace also got a too many men over the wall penalty. Um, after a long while, uh, green flag pit stop start. So William Byron takes the lead. Then Daniel Suarez takes the lead. Then Kyle Busch kind of got a controversial penalty where uh, he got a pitting outside the box penalty. Even though his front fender was barely touching like the line, they still penalized him for it. Um, and so after that, um, Michael McDowell took the lead. Then, uh, Derek, uh, Krause took the lead and led his first official lap in the cup series. After that, Kyle Larson take, uh, take, the lead. Uh, then Corey LaJoy ends up hitting the wall, bringing out the fourth caution of the race. And after the restart, uh, Larson and Chastain were battling for uh, like two laps until Larson got ahead and Larson just ran away with it. And Kyle Larson wins the Las Vegas Grand Prix. So the top five were Kyle Larson, um, Reddick, Ryan Blaney, Ross Chastain, and Ty Gibbs, who bounced back to finish in the top five. So good on him. Um, all in all, this kind of was a boring race. Um, everyone was so spread out. Like There was a little bit of action near the end, but... I mean, it wasn't really, like, close. I kind of had a feeling Kyle Larson was going to win. But I'm a Hendrick fan. I'm a little bit biased. Um, other than that, yeah. All right, so... I'm probably going to rate this race like a 6 out of 10. Not really much to say. Um, so yeah. Uh, that is going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you all very much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. As well as go check out my other two channels. One being my main of Fan and Tan. And the other one being a D&D &D channel called Drunkards and Dumbasses. But I believe it's under the Boundless Shores at the moment. Um, so, uh, thank you all very much for watching. And uh, join me next week when I review the Phoenix race. Peace.